after American Airlines, I moved on to TGI Fridays, and my okay. VP of marketing there was a gentleman by the name of Tom Konigsberg. And what I really appreciated about him was his balanced approach to everything. Um, his analysis always included both the consumer perspective and the ops perspective, and I think it's really important to take both perspectives when you're in the food and beverage business. Beautiful. So give me one specific nugget, reflecting back at your time with him. One thing, whether it's a, a scenario that played out, something that he did that you observed, or something that I don't know, maybe was like below the radar, like a, like a between the lines that you figured out just from observing him. Did anything come to mind just reflecting back at this time? Well, just generally speaking, in, in, in terms of the functional area that I was responsible for, which was R&D, you're charged with being incredibly creative and innovative. And so I worked with a team of chefs, and they came up with some wonderful items. We would present those items, and each time he would give us great positive feedback, but he would always come back to, well, how will they execute this in the restaurant? So it really taught me to t think through all of the various steps involved in delivering something, and you know, real, I finally realized that on a go-forward basis, it, it, everything you do, I mean, yes, it needs to be innovative, but it needs to be balanced with, you know, something that's executable. Is it, is it yeah, is it practical? Is it, it practical? Are we turning over all the stones? Like, this might be a great creative idea, but like... Can it be replicated consistently yeah, exactly. day in and day out? Because if it can't... How much is it going to cost? Are it, we going to be able to, like, turn a, re a profit on this? Exactly. Or is it gonna be, yeah, exactly. Every aspect of that item he evaluated, and I really learned a tremendous amount from him. 